She's a little squirter. That's just, you can't say that. <laughs> I know I shouldn't really. Good morning, folks. Welcome along to the vlog. Well, I say morning. It's actually afternoon. Um, we've pulled the mixer out. Uh, I've not used it. I've manually mixed today. Bit of sand over there. Bit of cement in this bucket. And we attacked where the cask washer sits. It didn't sit evenly. So if you look at this floor here, some bodger as uh, yeah, well, that, basically. And we've got this rib ridge here. This has always been here. Bit of a pain in the arse because we can't get the trolley jack up here very easy when it's laden. So I've had the SDS out on hammer mode and we basically took that section up and then I've replaced it with a brand new piece of concrete and leveled it. So hopefully when it's gone off the cask wash will just push back to the wall and it'll sit there nicely without leaning forwards as it previously did. Uh, and then we can start using it. We've got lots of casks to wash, wash even. Uh, just answer a quick question that somebody asked in the comments. Why did, didn't I use the angle for the corners? I didn't need to. I mean, they're, they're sealed up. Just holoclad all the way around. There we go. Robert's your mother's brother. And as you can see from this side, that silicon has gone off nicely. And that'll last forevermore. Little spot of water. Leaking from the ceiling or the roof. And there's also one over here, as you can see where we've got the ladder. So I've just been up and repaired that. This is an ongoing project. It was just coming through where that little black panel is there, look. And uh, dripping here on the boxes. So I thought, well, well, we've got a bit of time. We'll sort that leak out. We'll sort that leak out. I'm pretty sure there's another one around here. Maybe that's it, just there, can't really see it. And are there any more? They tend to show themselves on miserable days like this, or usually when I'm busy brewing. I wonder, there shouldn't be any there. Look, just on the edge, oh, I saw the drip. I did see the drip come down then, just where they've the cowboys replaced those panels. As you can see, the reason why they're cowboys is because the panels don't go over the top. Oh, that light's causing a problem here. But yeah, the panels don't go over the top of the ridge beam. You see, they're just flapping like a cock in the breeze. Isn't that right, Jim? Pretty big one to be flapping. This is a lot about me anyway. Uh, I'll bring them ladders over and we'll get this job done. So the plan is to pull up the carpet on the stairs, which because we're a dog friendly pub, harbours dog hair pretty bad, and refurbish it, maybe paint the risers and the treads. We're thinking about putting some beer labels on the risers and painting the treads black. What do you think? I can't go upstairs. 
with the camera though because Stuart's got bloody Disney music on. Underlay, carpet grips, carpet, all removed to expose the timber subfloor which is not really in terrible condition but it's not really in great condition either so a little bit of work to do to get it uh, ready for maybe a counter paint and then maybe some can label stickers on the risers and then a mural on that wall hopefully that will be coming soon some custom printed wallpaper and then we're going to paint all this black I think I don't know paint it all black and white black and white I think it'd look better black handles white uh, what do they call them balustrades what are they pickets uh, I don't know something like that black black white black black whatever color and then mural anyway that's enough for today's vlog so uh, we'll wrap it up on the staircase shot and we'll see you on the next one